Inkjet printers have revolutionized the production of color separations for screen, flexo, and litho printing. Wasatch Softdrip SP leads the way with the features you need to be successful with this type of printing. Softdrip SP is easy to learn and use, so even beginners with minimal background in film production will produce quality results fast. Only Softdrip SP has Wasatch Precision Rosette screens that produce perfect center-filled rosettes across the full width of your film, whether you're using a small or large format digital printer. Our award-winning rosettes and new customizable features combine to deliver a perfect inkjet separations tool that will seamlessly fit into your current workflow. In this training, you will learn how to create composite CMYK separations from within Wasatch Softdrip SP. To get started, open the Print Setup window. Change the imaging configuration to None. Click Edit and Properties to access the Printer Properties window. Options differ from one print driver to the next. To find out more about your specific print driver options, click Help in the Printer Properties window. Choose a mono print mode to print with a single color. Make sure you select a resolution that accommodates for the UV densities and LPI or frequency you're trying to achieve. We will discuss how to achieve correct UV densities in a separate training video. Select a dot type that accommodates for the half-toning method you plan to use. Select a dot size that accounts for your desired UV density. Select Advanced Controls. Check the box for Make Separations on RIP. This option tells Wasatch to perform composite CMYK separations on images once they are ripped. This option also allows you to choose the ink channel you wish to use for your separations. Any spot color separation should be handled using a graphics application. Click OK at the bottom of the printer properties window. Now select the half-toning method that you want to use. From the imaging configuration window, click the color transforms button. From the pull-down list between ink limit and half-tone properties, choose either PostScript screens or Wasatch Precision Rosette screens. If you select PostScript screens, adjustments can be made to the angle, frequency, and dot shape by selecting the Half-Tone Properties button. If you select Wasatch Precision Rosette screens, clicking on the Half-Tone Properties button will let you choose a rosette pattern to match your desired frequency, resolution, and dot shape settings. This window also gives you the option to create new screens if you don't find a desired pattern. We will discuss how you can generate your own Wasatch Precision Rosette screens in a separate training video. Once you've selected your halftone method, click OK to exit the color transform screen. Click OK once more and Wasatch will prompt you to save your new imaging configuration. Enter a name and click OK. You perform a proper linearization before you start to print composite separations. We will discuss how to perform a linearization in a separate training video. Now you're ready to start printing your composite separation. Select the file browser and drag an image into the job screen. Choose RIP and print. Move over to the queue screen. You will see that each of the four screens has been printed. On the right side of the print queue, there is a separation column. This column will tell you the name of each screen that was printed. Now you're ready to continue producing composite separations with Wasatch Softdrip SP.